the chance for rain will be diminishing pretty much throughout this morning, though there will still be a few spotty showers within parts of our area. Much cooler temperatures, and that's going to stick around over the next several days. In fact, looking into next week, we are going to be dropping even more in temperatures with some very cold mornings well below freezing for a good portion of our area as well. Now that next system into the weekend does look to bring additional rain and yes, even some snow with those colder temperatures. We're looking out east of the Cascades where the spotty showers are this morning going along uh, Klamath County, put now pushing into northern Lake County and you'll even see some of this light stuff into northern California. Not a whole lot of per additional precipitation expected from this. Maybe just a few hundreds of an inch as we're getting through this morning and your upper level system will continue pushing out to the east. You'll see some spotty showers extending all the way into uh, the northwest. And as you'll see going through today, that line of rain really starts to diminish. The chance for these spotty showers continues further north into Washington and northern Oregon and can't rule out a few spotty showers into uh, no, going up into our northern uh, coastal counties, as well as continuing into Klamath Lake, even Modoc County. But the rest of us, we're going to be staying dry, becoming mostly cloudy for tonight. We'll have that cloud cover continuing east of the Cascades into Thursday, and there's still that possibility for some spotty showers into Modoc and Lake County. Again, not a whole lot of precipitation expected uh, as we're getting through the rest of today. Any chance tomorrow looks to stay out east. So maybe a few hundreds of an inch. What we will be dealing with is the chilly temperatures continuing in the lower 60s for the coastline. Morning lows dipping into the mid and upper 40s. And again, cloud cover increasing for tonight, but mostly sunny for the West Valleys for this afternoon. High temperatures will be in the lower to mid 60s with those morning lows, a few upper 30s and lower 40s. So a chilly one tomorrow morning, but it's going to be even colder east of the Cascades. In fact, we're seeing 20s to start off the morning up towards Christmas Valley and Shamalta uh, at or below freezing for much of the eastern half of our area. We'll be warming a few degrees into Thursday, staying into the mid and upper 60s throughout this weekend, and then we dip into the 50s for highs next week. Morning lows dropping to the 30s. The chance for some showers looks to take over into Sunday, Monday, and diminishing into Tuesday. And that's going to be pretty common across our area, though the colder temperatures for the climate basin, morning lows, upper 20s and low 30s, goes all the way into next week with highs dropping to the upper 40s and lower 50s. Northern California will be in the 50s next week, but 60s all the way throughout this weekend and the coastline staying into the 60s. There is another cold front that's going to bring a chance for some showers late Friday, early Saturday, then that better set up into Sunday and Monday.